Me and people are starting a business venture together. Welcome back to my channel. So I decided I'm just going to start the vlog today. It's kind of like I already did a ton of stuff today, but I'm just going to start the vlog because it's going to be an actual like fighting weekend for me. And I just want to take you along. Like these are the things that I'm supposed to be vlogging anyways. So I went to dinner with my friends last night and I didn't vlog that, but that was the start of my weekend. It was actually Thursday night. Uh, we went out and celebrated Caitlyn's birthday. Happy birthday, birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Caitlin. Pictures here. Happy birthday, Caitlin. Thank you for being such a good friend. Um, and now today is Friday. We just went and did our workout. Out. Um, and then we are now running errands. So excitingly, me and Pico are starting a new business venture together. Um, it's a juice bar. It's called Pure. So if you're in the South Florida area and you want to support us, let me know. But yeah, it's called Pure. So we're just doing a lot of running around for it because we are doing something very exciting tomorrow. We are putting up our tent at our first farmer's market. We decided that's the route that we want to start off with. Um, so we're here at FedEx. We're getting banners printed. We got stickers printed. We ordered our bottles. We have to go pick up our fresh fruits because we didn't want to get our fruits too far in advance. Um, and then we have the juice tonight because we want it as fresh as possible for tomorrow. I hope you guys can hear me, but let me just take you guys along. I'll kind of chat with you guys a little bit more about it when I get on my camera because I have my phone right now just to keep y'all in the loop. Say hi. All right, just a little, I have my little notebook here. Thanks, Joe, for this. Um, but this is how our juice bar looks. This is the brand, Pure Juice Bar, and these are our menus that we printed out. Um, so yeah, I'm really, really excited. We also got a banner made for our tent, and I'll show you guys uh, some more stuff when I get them. Okay, I hope I don't look too crazy on my phone, but we just got something else done. We print, we made it, we made a cash app sign as far as payment wise. If y'all um, want to cash us, cash app us right now, y'all scan the shit right now. Well, cash app us right now. Anyways, um, so like I said, we're doing our first farmer's market. Are you excited? Super excited, man. Super duper excited. Um, it's kind of big. We've been thinking about doing this for a while. You guys don't know, Pico is very health conscious. Um, and because he is, I've grown to become very health conscious as well. Not very health conscious, but I'm more health conscious. Um, and with me taking my weight, my body journey serious again. Fitness journey. Fitness journey. There we go. So yeah, we, we've juiced in the past at our old apartment. We've juiced and we've always talked about, you know, like, how beneficial juicing is um and we just thought you know why not just sell it like why not um so yeah we're finally doing it and we just we're doing it and we're we want to be official one thing about me if i'm gonna do something it's gonna look official okay so we've We've invested in this, um, getting the right juicer um, that is going to not only juice, but still leave nourishment in the juices. Um, there's different types, you can look it up. There's like mechanical or slow juicer. It's, it's a difference. So we invested in a new juicer. We got a banner, we're getting a tent. And like I said, we just thought, you know, a farmer's market would be the best bet to start. So uh, tomorrow is our first day there. So we're just kind of using today to, to do last minute earrings. The only thing that we needed that we didn't get was business cards. Um, but you know, we'll, we'll, we'll just kind of roll with that. We'll order some for next week. Um, but yeah, really, 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 really exciting. Right now we're on our way to get our fruits, like I mentioned. And I'll take you guys along. I'm mad I didn't bring my camera because I didn't think I was going to start vlogging. But I'm like, why not? Like, why not? This is before the before. This is before the before. This is the process. 
we spent hours doing this like we were at office depot fedex and of course we could have ordered all of this online and it probably would have saved us a little bit more money um but we just dove into it like like I said, we've had this business idea for a while, but we just crank it into high gear and we didn't have time to um, order anything because we signed up for the farmer's market and we're like, okay, we're doing it, you know, all within like a week or two, so. This is like kind of green. The darker this is, means it's been off the vine a little bit longer. So, and then you don't want it too hollow. You know what I'm saying? You want it to have a little weight to it. I mean, it's juicy. This, this watermelon here, not too bad. He think he knows something. Me like one of them over there still. He don't know what he's doing. He doesn't know what he's doing. Yeah. Those are the ones that are the sweetest. Which ones? I always look for those. The, the, the widest. The it's wide. Like the white is white. Oh. Huh. So I, that's what I always look for. So like something like this? Yeah. Yeah. That's jackpot? jackpot? Yeah, so that's, that's what I do. We're going to we're gonna go with it. <laughs> We're gonna go with it. I'm gonna come be looking for you. <laughs> yeah, just don't tell me cool it, bro. You just strike down in your coconut. chest. Yes, lick me, bad. Hurry up. My battery is dying, so I'm, I have to charge it. But just showing you guys all the stuff that we bought. All right, you guys, so we finally made it back in the house from running all our errands today. We got all of our fruits, and they're all, like, up here. Um, we basically are making... We're making four juices to start off with. Um, we're making a watermelon juice, a green juice, a pineapple juice, and a beet juice. Put off all of up here, sanitized it down. We got our juicer. We got our cutting boards down. We bought new knives today. finally done it is 12 56 so call it one o'clock in the morning we did not have dinner we just finished juicing cleaning up packing everything in the car because we have an early morning tomorrow but yeah you guys i am tired i am beat like we worked out we was on constant go today and it's gonna be a, a whole on go weekend so that's why i wanted to vlog um tomorrow should be fun sunday should be fun so yeah i'm gonna go get some sleep because i look crazy the bags are bagging are they chanel are they dior no they're tired <sighs> i don't know what i'm saying anymore good night you guys i'll see you guys in the morning good morning you guys so the day is here first farmer's market i am dressed i am wearing just this gray body so babe is also wearing a gray top um he didn't have gray bottoms so he's wearing blue but i wanted us to look like a teen all in my phone, I got options And I don't wanna tell you to drop it But I don't wanna play your fair Yeah, something That makes me look at you too often oh, Baby, you can give it something Baby, I can run all the time Baby, 
I'm talking crazy I need you right in my space But I need it, baby, I'm late But I still can check in with you I know that I need my friends But I wouldn't want to leave You know I Hey guys, so crazy crazy. I need to catch y'all up. So basically, we left the our first um, farmer's market. It was a success. Everything went great. Um, I ra literally ran home, took 10 minutes, 10 minutes to shower, fix my hair, fix my edges, and throw on my outfit. Thank God I picked out what I was going to wear already. And throw my makeup in a Ziploc bag. And I just did it in the car because I'm going to meet another YouTuber. Walking in Swim Week, which is really exciting, Swim Week Miami. And she invited me there and got me a ticket. Um, but, you know, I had already had and paid for the farmer's market spot. So we just needed to do that. Um, but I was, like, determined to make this. Fortunately, um, we have a flat. So we're dealing with that as well. But honestly, we're just trying to get there. I have to get there by 3. Right now, we're kind of cutting it really really close by like three minutes but i think we should be fine um i'll show you guys my outfit and everything and you guys will see who i'm meeting um i think i should be fine with vlogging but yeah just wanted to check in and let you guys know that our first farmer's market was a success um, it was fun um we didn't even stay the whole time like i said because we had to leave early but yeah i also got her some flowers and stuff so I'm just excited. I don't know how to wear my hair. Okay, there we go. Because the makeup was looking a little crazy just now. But she needs to So bad at this but um as you guys see i just met petite sue or sue um 
honestly i've been watching her for years and she is in miami so let's link so here we are um and love the energy love the vibes you know i just feel like conversation was um good flowing nothing seen force um i was nervous coming into this because you know when you watch somebody online which is probably how y'all some of y'all may feel about me because y'all tell me this all the time but when you watch somebody online like meeting them might be a little weird um so i didn't really know what it was gonna give but it's giving it's giving it's giving she's cool as hell real down to earth y'all know she's jamaican so yeah we're vibing there um and i also got to meet um Peyton as well which is also she's really cool I recently started watching her a few months ago so I can't even lie I haven't been watching her a long long time but vibes is good as well we went out to eat and I just kind of did b-roll for you guys I didn't really do much talking but we went to honestly I don't even know the name of the restaurant but I recorded the menu so y'all could see um it's on ocean drive um yeah we was there for a while we ate had some drinks the drinks were so good like i had a mango margarita mango margarita i think that's what i got bomb honestly it was such a big serving it was good and y'all know i don't like drinking okay but it was giving um and then yeah we just kind of talked started to get to know each other a little bit um the vibes was cool um and y'all know me and people we only have uno dos car uno dos uno car but honestly too driving to south beach is a no-no like you either get dropped off or take uber so i told him instead of me taking the car just just drop me off which is what he did um so when we got done with the restaurant he wasn't back over in the area so i just came to sue's hotel with her um and i'm waiting for him now he should be here soon um, but I know there's a lot of traffic getting over here. So, yeah. I'm in Sue's room right now. Um, she's getting changed to go to dinner. Or to go hang out with, um, Peyton some more downstairs. And then I'm gonna head home and do some editing. I have outing tomorrow that I'm taking y'all along with. So, yeah. We outside this weekend. Outside not in. You know what I mean? Um... So yeah, <laughs> I have to go home. I have to do some laundry because I was supposed to do laundry yesterday. But y'all know me and people is on the road all day. Um, so I need to do some laundry, finish uploading the vlog, and just get some sleep because I didn't get much sleep. And then tomorrow, I'm meeting up with the girls for Bree's birthday. Um, we're doing brunch at Sola Miami, I believe the restaurant is called. Um, I heard they, their mimosas are really good. But I'm going to like take y'all along there. And we're going to see what the vibes is hitting for. Um, and then yeah. I might meet up with Sue again. Tomorrow night. We'll, we'll play by ear and see what's, what's happening. But you guys I washed my braids. This morning. Best thing I could have did. Because <laughs> look at the curly pieces. They look so good now. At first they were starting to look a little dry out. Mm mm. And my edges look good too. Ooh, they look ooh, chad. Never mind. Never mind on the edges because these babies is. They look crazy. Like I said, I just wanted to pop in, chat to y'all because I was just getting B roll. I wasn't really talking that much. So, see y'all later. Good morning, you guys. Good morning, baby. Good morning, y'all. It's Sunday, July 9th. And I'm heading out to celebrate my girl's Bree's birthday. We're doing brunch at, I think it's like called Sola Miami. Um, so I'm all dressed. Babe is dropping me off to Cynthia's house so I can ride with them there. Um, I'm excited. I have, I have this little fit on that I was going to wear in Jamaica, but I never wore it. So I'm like, might as well wear it now. But as I'm sitting here, I'm noticing like, why am I on woolly pie green? And the green, them don't match. Them don't match. But I'm gonna give you guys an outfit of the day when I can. Um, we're trying to get to Cynthia's house right now. And yeah, I just wanted to check in. I also packed a little bag that's in the trunk just in case um, me and Sue decide to meet up. We're kind of just like cleaning by ear and seeing like what time I leave brunch um, and stuff like that. So yeah, I guess I will keep you guys updated. Oh, 
parking out here is crazy. <laughs> how how long have you spent looking for parking? 40 minutes. Yeah, it's it's actually wild. But God will provide. We are here. We are eating at Sola Miami. It's on Collins Ave. It's on Collins? Mm -hmm. Yeah, Collins Ave. Um, we're gonna see what it's about. I can't see Shimon. Anytime with the girls is always a vibe. So Again, I didn't really talk to you guys as much, um, but I went and you guys saw I celebrated with Brie, um, with all my friends. That was a time. Every time we all hang out, it's always a vibe. Like, it's always a vibe. It's, it's so many girls. Why am I yelling? Relax. Relax. I don't know. I'm hype. Coming from hanging out with my friends, I get, you know, louder because you have to be loud in a group of girls to be heard. But anyways, what I was going to say, yeah, that was a time, singing out with them, it's now 
six o'clock. Um, we we got there by like around two, so we were there for a while. Um, beer vibes, beer vibes. That was fun. And then I hit up Sue again, and she invited me on a yacht with her, um, and some other people. So I'm actually gonna go. But it's funny because. I anticipated us hanging out, but I really didn't know what we we're gonna do. Like I said, we we're just playing it by ear. So I'm like, you know, I'm gonna be down here where she's at, like down in South Beach, so I can bring a night fit for dinner if she wanna go grab drinks or like appetizers or something. I could bring a chill fit, um, which was like some shorts and a and a tee, like crap. And then I could bring like swimsuit because it's miami like you could go to the pool you could go to the spa you could go to a beach club you go to the beach um so i just packed everything i'm naturally an overpacker so i think ahead it's better to have it and make me not say damn i wish i brought that you know so i threw everything in the back just throw it out you know what i mean um so it's funny when she invited me i'm like perfect i have swims i have swimsuit but the thing is, the only thing is, I don't think the swimsuit that I brought is giving yacht. It's not shaking my ass on a thong, in a thong on a yacht. You know what I'm saying? It's giving more modest girl. It's giving more, <laughs> I'm cute, you know? But it's fine. It's fine. I don't think that's the vibe they were going for anyways. <laughs> I cracked myself up, y'all. I cracked myself up. And this is me sober. I didn't have a lick of alcohol today. But anyways... What I was saying? <laughs> yeah, it's, it's not giving shake your ass in a thong on a yacht. I don't think that's the type of uh, group that I'm going to be with. You know, I might be with the more mature, you know, relaxed girls. And that's fine. And I think the outfit will fit in. But, you know, I don't know. It's like I'm prepared but unprepared. It's like I didn't think that far ahead like yacht. You know what I mean? But anyways, I say all this to say, my man is my um personal driver and which is perfect i love that for me because when you are down here in miami don't drive because parking is going to be just as much as your uber so just take a little nice uber um in my case i have my man he could come and pick me up because we live in miami so he came and picked me up from the brunch spot um, and I'm going to head to Sue's Hotel. Um, and I'm going to change over, change off over there. And then we're going to go to the yacht together. So yeah, vibes, vibes, vibes. This weekend, I'm having so much fun. From Thursday up till Sunday, I'm having fun. I was able to post my vlog today, which you guys, I worked so hard on that vlog. So if you haven't already watched part two of Jamaica, the Jamaica vlog, just go watch it. Just go give it a nice little like. You know what I mean? Because your girl worked hard, like blood sweat and some tears yesterday i thought i lost all the footage y'all i was literally about to shoot myself in the head um anyways that's a little dramatic but yeah i am chatting right now why but i feel like, I mean, I feel like sometimes i don't be talking to y'all that much you know and sometimes i just have to talk to and like a like a proper sit down and talk so that's what i be doing but yeah another thing is i feel like i need a shower um is that gonna be weird showering in a hotel i don't know <laughs> you know <laughs> that's my nervous laugh i think it's fine she's she's nice she's so like laid back and like i get genuine vibes from her like you know what i mean like it's not like mean girl it's not like may i try to uh like it's just vibes. It's just it's just genuineness. It's just flowing. It's just like, do you know what I mean? I don't know how to explain it any other way. That's the best way I could put it. She doesn't give me stuck up vibes. She doesn't give judgy vibes. She doesn't give judgy vibes. That's it. So yeah, shout out to her for that. Um, what else? I think that's it. Pico went to go grab something to eat really quick. So I'm just sitting in the car. I took some really cute picture and TikTok today. So at least I accomplished something else. But yeah. I'ma holler at y'all in a little bit. When I when I when I get over there.
Bye bye. <laughs>Alright you guys, so we just got to the dock. Yeah. And we are getting on a yachty yacht. The sun is about to go down. Yeah. Oh, it's o'clock usually. 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 Y'all, yeah, I had to change so fast. I'm not even vlog, we don't know. But this is what I choose to wear. I kept on the same skirt that I had on earlier and I just put on the pink pink bikini. That I had this bikini for like three years, Chad. I haven't worn it, but I'll make that pint of duty if it takes swimming class because this body. Yeah, people should definitely learn to swim. Am I gonna learn to swim? No, but the amount of tropical vacation I go on and, and can't swim that look bad. I come here, Jamaica, the man asks me, You want to go blue wall, my sister? Really and truly? I'm not. got blue wall, me I'm dead. Right? Uh uh, don't no, come back over here. Don't bring your BJs back over here. <laughs> <laughs> Where glass? It's in the bag. Let's oh, mash up. I think I left it. Left it. No. Hey y'all, let me take that ponytail out oh, because mm. it had give me a piece of stress. Okay. All right. Hey guys. So we just got off the boat. That was a vibe. Like. Cool breeze, you just uh, you just you know what you like. Mukara take a nap. Maybe I trim lazy. Boy, look on the edges. Jesus. No no. But I'm leaving soon now. Pika come for me. They're about to go have dinner and then they're probably gonna go out tonight. And I'm just gonna go home and be alone. <laughs> but no, I had so much fun this weekend, you guys. Like meeting Sue and painting them and also hanging out with my friends it was a vibe. it was a late and i hope this vlog shows it because i have fun like i was never sitting down this whole entire weekend what is sitting down but i'll be sitting down next week though because i got shit to do but sue coming out of the vlog thank you <laughs> So you did in there to do one time. No, you can't look take it and put it in a while. Over it. No, man, dead for hungry. Hungry, hungry, hungry. I'm so crazy. I'm ever hungry. Anybody <laughs> want to know me? No, but, but true. It's been I, a long day. All I, I feel like too. Sandwich. When you're when you a Jamaican, like a Jamaican food, fool you all. Yeah. But when you eat like. Like a sandwich, sandwich. Yeah, it's like. It's not really done. This not is no substance. Yeah. Like, I don't know if you can't do it. I don't know if you can't cook it in Jamaica. I said, boy, you don't chop out asparagus. And I'm like, go up to the people. I'm like, I'm not even doing it. 
because she's talking about how do you like the asparagus? <laughs> the premier, the girl, one time I'm cooking, I'm cooking one stove top. It's what I saw on Google first. I tried it; it was good, and that's that. How much is y'all cooking for the stove top? But no, 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 no. But it's like when I get technical, I'm like, I'm getting more than I'm like, and I saw pork. I saw some pork. Ah. Girl, I'm a little pork. Don't forget that I'm a pork man, but that's not good for you. Shut up, man. Eat the damn pork. Who said that? Pico. You make it pork. No, he, him like it, you know. Like when we got Jamaica, my mother cook pork in the middle. No, so, so man. Why, like. why you cuss me every time he try cook it? He's like, pork is not the best meat for you. you okay. 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 I'm like, who asked you? I'm still like, eat it. But then, I'm not talking about that. I'm eating pork. Don't look at me. I don't know what she's doing. Mama thinks so I'm gonna go there and come and feel away from go back home. I'm gonna get no name because I'm gonna see them, 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 them bougie. You know, because I'm gonna pound Uber Eats. I was like, I yeah. was gonna Uber Eats some. No, Dutch part, they pound Uber Eats, but I'm not thinking them have Niger pork. So when you're gonna do it, I don't know, but I have to get something well, from tomorrow. No, that's everything delay. Yeah. I have to get some. Guys, I'm trapping in Miami. Mm. I just want to spend spend look more time with me. I, and I don't have the time. No, I feel to bad go. still. Let me feel I bad. Know, I know. Guys, I work. Me have to go and go work. One like, thing you can, yeah, it, it's so no, bad. It's like different, I know you can do. No, yeah, and I've never been in this situation, so no, it's like I don't know how to react. Yeah. It's like you really better than me because me, me not like stress. Me start ball. No, me never. Me start it. ball. No, because it's like it's something very serious. It's like yeah. I but have to report to somewhere, yeah. and then I'm like yeah. trapped. Like it's weather condition. Yeah. Why mm. we're standing? But yeah. y'all got to um see see me and Sue together. I know a bunch of y'all watch her because it come up as like people you your other followers watch. Yeah, yeah. you see that on YouTube. That's it. It was a vibe. It was nice meeting you. It was nice meeting you too. You cool, <laughs> like, you know? Yeah. It didn't feel like no pressure. Like, I somebody have, me have me on, and Sometimes I meet people, sometimes I feel like they have me on a, a heavy microscope. It's yeah. Like, yeah. You catch my look, it's like... And then tell them to them, I say, like, I feel like there's no judgment. Mm, no. Like, it's just easy going, like... Yeah, you can tell. You know, you know? you're regular. But yeah. yeah. But anyways, guys, I'm gonna close out the vlog here. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Okay. Bye. <laughs>